Hi everyone, and welcome back to another episode of Rich Air Shunt. As you can see, we're back on the two pound coin hunt. No book, because there's no update, but we're basically waiting for <coughs> Northern Ireland and the 21 Britannia if it ever appears. Right, okay. So we'll just get on. Uh, 19th of the 10th is the bag date. Oh, that one didn't want to go down there, so we'll start with this one. Zoom in. And there we go. Right, technologies, not really a whole lot of interest in those for me. Um, I may check them. That's a very nice 2009. Look at that. Strip. Yeah. I must... Uh, Check that one against my date run. Um, but yeah, unless they're spanking gorgeous like that one. Um, rotation errors or double die errors. I don't really have much interest in them. And that bag is the best as well. Truth, come on, give me a commemorative. Indian, St. Paul's will do. Oh, yeah. Ask and you will receive. Charles Dickens. There we are. Started us off. We may have finished us off as well. That was... And the Act for the Abolition of the Slave Trade, 1807, and Shakespeare's Histories, the most common of the three. It's still nice to see it. Nothing else. There's a Florida Snake again. Shakespeare's Tragedies. What a piece. It's a correct edge inscription. This looks a bit suspect. Oh, you see when we get there now. It's just the edge on it is a bit beat up, to say the least. This one, it's the Act of Union. First bag. Another best bag. Just 
Charles Dickens again. Nothing else. Another past. Kind of lost faith in this bag. There's going to be anything in here. That's usually when I get proven wrong. Yeah. Oh dear me. The coin we do not name. Oh, I do not name anyway. Forgot that was in yet. Achievements. Another act of union. No rotation. Two bags left. Oh, there's a Britannia. That shiny, I think, is probably going to be a 16. Yeah. Still a nice find. Relatively low minted guy. Shakespeare's tragedies, piece of work. There's a very, very shiny Lord Kitchener, two pounds, so unfortunately, not the mule error. So it's sticking his nose out, did you? Trinity House. Yeah, lots of cut errors in the corner of that one. Not in very nice condition either, so. Not one I would be keeping. And there is a DNA. Last four bags. There's a, another little kitchener, two pounds. Swap this around, because I might oh, probably be book upgrade that one. St. Paul's, it's not our first one of those, it is. Straight. Very shiny 15. That's gonna be something. 1807. Brunel's achievements. Oh, Brunel the man. Let's do that. Final bag. Another Britannia there. I think it's a Britannia anyway. That's not it. Golden Guinea, that's in pretty nice condition. 
I might keep that one. Yeah, another 16 Britannia to finish us off. There we are. Oh, yes. Forgot about this. Um, going through the technologies from um, Friday's hunt. I found this. You might just say, oh, it's just, just the technologies. What's the fuss, Rich? It's, I don't know if this show, it'll show up too well on that. Oh, yeah, let's do that. It's a double clipped planchette error. One there. And a smaller one there. So that, I thought, that's interesting. So that will go in the book with the uh, with the other one. I can't remember whether it was this book or the one. Actually, I can check quite easily, don't I? The book is next to me. Oops. Which one was it? No, it was the book before. There we are. See, there's a clip punch out there, along with the Victory NAFC I found. Um, so that's a double clip. So yeah, no, you can't see any of that, can you? That one there, that's a clip punch on the side there. That one has a double clip, top and bottom. So yeah, interesting. Right, not a fantastic hunt, only really the one and a half, call it two, two keepers. That was from previous hunt. And one to check for my date run, but so it goes sometimes, isn't it? When you're only waiting for one coin, it's going to take a while. Right. Thanks for watching, guys. And uh, I'll see you all on the next hunt. Bye for now.